guys, welcome back to the Coco channel and to the very first day of the Christmas holiday season. Um, so this year we're doing things a little bit different. I asked you and I also put up a poll that I didn't know actually went through on YouTube. If you wanted me to do daily vlogs or weekly vlogs, it was a pretty unanimous decision that you guys wanted me to keep with weekly vlogs. A lot of you were super, super sweet and were worried about me doing videos every single day while coming up on eight month mark for pregnancy so um it makes more sense even though i really do <laughs> wish i could do every single day there's just the reality is I would be way too tired. So I thought since I'm still keeping up with the weekly vlogs, I would toss in more regular videos that are Christmas themed. Um, so I am gonna do a gift guide this year for my first year. I've never done one. And I'm gonna split it up into him, her, and children. And then um, today, as you can tell from the title, to kick it off, I thought I would do a Target dollar spot haul. Um, I do one of these every year every year. I do one of these for every season and holiday that comes up. I love and also live in the Target dollar spot. Um, if you've been with me for a while, you know this. Jacqueline and I had like a whole entire Snapchat story with each other about the Target dollar spot. She found some amazing stuff before I did. So without further ado and welcoming you to the 2017 um, Coco Channel holiday season, let's go ahead and jump into this haul. So let's get some big stuff out of the way. I feel like Target Dollar Spot has some really cute decor for our holidays. The first thing I picked up is this Merry Christmas wooden plaque. Um, I just thought this would be really, really cute in my little background. I love to get my seasonal decor for my beauty room in the Dollar Spot. It doesn't make sense for me to drop a ton of money on stuff um, for like just a little bit of area that you guys see. So I absolutely love this. This was $3 and it is nice quality. It's nice and heavy. It doesn't feel like thin wood where it's gonna break in half or anything like that so I'm really excited for you guys to start seeing this in my little background. I got two little um, costume and jewelry sets because I do have a Christmas party to go to um, in two weeks I want to say for my mom's group and so I got this really cute necklace that has bows on it and then I got these amazing jingling earrings and each of these were three dollars as well which i went to like where the actual like jewelry section is where they have christmas stuff and the quality wasn't much better than this and it was like twice or three times the cost so three dollars for a cute little necklace and a cute little pair of earrings that i'm gonna wear just a couple of times in the next month i'm okay with oh i lied i have one more pair of earrings and their little santa hat Seriously, how cute are those? There's a close-up of the bows. And then just doing this. So, like I said, three bucks each, not bad. I did get my son a couple of the Christmas toys. I don't get him a ton because literally I'll buy him something and he'd rather play with the tag than the actual toy. But he has been into bouncing balls lately, so I got him this really cool one that has like a holographic confetti and a little snowman on the inside. And then I did get him this light up reindeer because he does enjoy lights and each of these were only a dollar so I don't feel like I'll miss out too much if he's like me <laughs> okay some more decor that I picked up this bad boy that says fa la 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 it's like strung on the inside this was three dollars and I just thought it was so stinking cute even if I want to like change up the background maybe and even like the background on it is like snowflakes I just thought this was so stinking cute and then I did get some more lights I have these little starry lights which are cute but I wanted something a little bit bigger and so I got these amazing stars in rose gold um and it just says six feet long I don't know how many actual stars are on there it's definitely more than six let's see two four six 810 so that's not bad plus six feet and if it's something that I really like I could also put this in baby girls room because it's like that beautiful rose gold and these were five dollars which is a little bit pricier but starry lights are expensive and I like that these are battery operated I don't have to worry about a plug or anything like that I prefer battery operated although there are a ton of people that do not they say that batteries are like oh not a waste but 
yeah, wasteful. Some more little decor uh, that I think I'm going to put on gifts this year <sighs> for like big gifts. I got this really cute little, I don't know if it's a deer or a moose, um, wooden tag and then I got these ice skates wooden tag. Uh, you guys will see in like my weekly vlogs for Vlogmas when I start wrapping that my whole entire theme this year is like buffalo plaid which was a complete accident but you guys already probably heard or will hear the story coming up. So got these little ice skates and this little buffalo and they were only a dollar each and I think that I am such a freak about packaging and presentation. I absolutely love it. It makes me so happy when everything like matches and isn't exactly the same but still has like a theme so I know I'm a freak uh, moving on to some more packaging and wrapping things um, Target dollar spot had a ton of really cool stuff uh, I am going to be sending out packages for friends and family um, in the next week probably so I got quite a few things of washi tape the first one is the glitter trees which you can put like on a tag like how they have it here or um, I do like my outside of my boxes for Christmas I decorate them with like stickers and like even the address labels I decorate um, <laughs> this one is a silver glitter snowflake is that one the next one I got is a beautiful white with metallic red and it has little snowflakes I guess and then it says believe on it I absolutely love this one. I think this one's so pretty. And I love how they did like their little tag with two different washi tapes, or three, three different washi tapes and made a tag out of it. And then I did get a Buffalo Snow one to go with my theme. I got a ton of stickers because like I said, I go ham on the outside of boxes for packaging. Just so even when it gets there, like people are excited. That's like the best thing about Christmas is how excited people get. I love it. So we got this vintage um, kind of wonderland and it has like the Santa and holly and ivy and mistletoe. Some more of that, but these ones are 3D. Again, with like the vintage Santa. Um, I got metallic letters in red you can't really see them that well they're just block letters um i got these candy cane block letters this one that says special delivery from the north pole which i thought would be fun to put on aiden's little gifts um and then some more 3d ones that are kind of the same very classic vintage like mistletoe just green and red nothing like super fancy i got two more things of letters because i always end up running out of letters and then I got numbers I don't know why but it was that same theme like the green and red and last but not least I did get some twine this is metallic red with white um I did quite a few of Shauna's presents with twine and I really like the way it turned out so I got some different colors the one that I have is like a giant spool and it's like gold and silver so I wanted some red um a few more things um, I got a wooden stamp that says do not open until Christmas, December 25th. It just says December 25th, not Christmas. Um, and then I got some things for some really exciting stuff coming up. Uh, for um, Vlogmas this year, I am going to do a giveaway a week, but that will be announced in my... Um, vlogmas and so uh i got four different pouches and i'm just gonna cram as much stuff in there as i can i did get two things of ballpoint pens uh these aren't really that christmasy but they were at the dollar spot i have no pens in my office i have a bag full of sharpies that are like skinny and just the regular old-fashioned sharpies in like every single color but i don't have pens to like sit down and write out certain things and then that's it oh last thing are some wooden tags that I can put some of the stickers on just to make it a little bit more fancy and I feel like the wood goes really well with the buffalo plaid uh, I'm just so excited and then 
Um, this wasn't in the dollar spot, but I just thought I would share it with you since it's in my bag anyway. And again, Buffalo Plaid, it's for a gift card for a certain somebody. Uh, and it says Joy on it. It's like super, super cute. And again, it has the twine. So this whole entire thing, I didn't have to do anything to. And it goes with my theme. I was um, <laughs> setting everything up and I realized I forgot to show you just a few more things um, before I do my outro. So I found this cute little cookie jar um, and this was $5 which is cheaper than your regular candy cookie jars but we actually use this for dog treats. There's little bones in there and then they did have tins this year um they were three dollars each which was cheaper than going back to like the baking section and um this weekend coming up my husband has guard he goes one weekend a month um and because this is the only weekend in december they're having their christmas party obviously now and so my husband signed up for desserts long story short uh and so i got this really cute candy cane and it says merry christmas this plaid one that says made with love and then a cute little mistletoe joy again with the buffalo plaid so just those are the last things I swear now I'm gonna say goodbye so that is it for this um, holiday haul it is a Christmas haul if Christmas is a word that offends you I do apologize but that is what I celebrate so that is what I do say I'm never offended if you wish me a happy Hanukkah or Kwanzaa or anything of that nature so let's just keep it amazing my I'm not a very PR channel anyway or PC PR politically correct um so I'm so excited for this Christmas and holiday season we have a ton of stuff planned I feel a little bit more relaxed and not as stressed out in doing weekly vlogs instead of daily because even this week there have been days where I literally couldn't get anything and get my camera out like I couldn't I just couldn't do I couldn't get my camera out just couldn't do it so those are the days where I'm like thank goodness I have other stuff that way I don't have to cram something Christmas in every single day I just have to fit something Christmas in the week and I can do that um, and it's gonna be an amazing amazing vlogmas season so I thank you so much for watching if you are new hello and welcome my name is Brittany Coco you are watching the Coco channel please subscribe if you're not already and I will catch you guys in my next video